Hi, this is Christina Hills from the website Creation Workshop and in this video I want to show you how to install the classic editor so you can work in WordPress and edit your pages and blog posts the way you're used to. So let me just first show you the issue. So I'm in this site and I'm going to edit one of my pages and when I come in here this looks totally different. I'm not familiar with this. This is the WordPress block editor and the block editor is referred to as Gutenberg. But let's say you're not ready to work with Gutenberg yet. You want to keep working the way you've always been used to working. So if you want that and if you come in here and it looks like this then you'll need to install the classic editor. So to do that I'm going to come to plugins, add new, and I could type in classic editor but you'll see how popular this is. It's right here. So if you don't see it here at the top classic editor just type in classic editor. So I'm going to click install now and I'm going to click activate. And looking at installed plugins I'm just going to look at my settings. So default editor for all users is now set to the classic editor. I could switch to the block editor if I wanted to try out the new editor, but I think I'll wait for now. And you can allow users to switch between editors if you want that ability. I'm just going to set that to no. So now when I go over to my pages and I click to edit this, and I'm in text mode, let me get to visual mode. I'm now in the normal WordPress editor that I'm used to. And in this page I happen to be doing a little bit of formatting, but the point is this area should look familiar, this area should look familiar, it is back to normal. So that's it. That is how you install the classic editor for WordPress so that you can edit your pages and your blog posts in the way you've been used to for all these years in WordPress. This is Christina Hills from the website Creation Workshop.